Welcome to Filmmakers Talk. Today's episode is about film school. Alright, so let's talk about film school. So I did not go through film school, but I kind of made my own film school in college. So I um, took several creative writing classes. I took several acting classes. Um, I took electronic media to learn all of the Adobe products, um, photojournalism to to uh, learn about the camera and things like that. So I kind of created my own version uh, and pieced it all together. But people say that the biggest advantage of going to film school is networking. Otherwise, going to film school is kind of pointless because you can get the same education by watching YouTube and there's so many other ways to get that content. So um, I wanted to hear you guys, uh, you know, what you guys think. And if there is, if networking is the only valuable thing about going to film school, can we get that somewhere else? So what do, what do you guys think? So I can't speak to film school directly because like you, I've never actually been there. Um, so, but here's the thing about school in general. Um, the school gives people a chance to grow together, um, whether that be high school, college. Um, so you grow together with a group of people and that's a pretty strong bonding experience. Um, think about the times you've grown with people. Uh, like school. Now think about the times you've just been with people that you work with, you know, that you just kind of hang out with at work. Which of those tend to stick with you the longest? The ones you grew with or the ones you just worked with? The ones you grew with, of course. Why? Well, because you grew with them. There was more to it than that. Now, I disagree with the assertion that uh, the only value to film school is networking. Uh, it may be the primary value. It may be a primary value, but I think there's also a value to sharpening the saw, to spending that time dealing with um, with knowledge and with projects that you either wouldn't have otherwise done or which push you in directions that you wouldn't otherwise have led yourself uh, led yourself um, it also puts you puts you in directions where you may not have had the opportunity really otherwise so there's values to that again maybe that falls on the networking uh, I'm thinking just curriculum in this case but um but yeah so so I would say is there a value to that sure but I guess it depends very much on the person I can speak firsthand of this because I'm actually currently enrolled in a film school. And I'd say that, you know, technically you can learn anything on YouTube, but there's a difference between just being told something on YouTube versus actually like being told how to do it and then like going out there and doing it. There's a difference in watching me go, oh, you set up a camera at this exposure, this focal length. And then there's an actual difference between going out there, you know, being, being tasked an assignment to do it having it do and then having friends that you're in that class with doing it with you it's a like you said it's a good growing experience and then you also helps you way up sharpen your tools a bit more in my opinion when it comes to actually you know going out there and practicing so i went to film school <laughs> a long time ago and uh i literally only talked to like one person out of that entire class but it's like everybody from there was like from a different state which is great you know it's it's good to do that networking and you know, get other, you know, ideas and things from people, but like lots of people, as soon as they leave, it's like they're going back to their own lives. Some people, you, if you don't get into film like right away, like personally me, I had to get a nine to five job, you know, I had student loans to pay off, I had life happen. So it's tough. And like, so it was like a huge gap where I did nothing. And that's trying to get back into it is like the toughest, but the minute you get on set, you make connections. And it's like networking that way is just, to me, super beneficial. I've never been, even if it's like a bad film set and it's like no pay, whatever, I've always found benefits in like people I've met. Mm -hmm. You know, just, you know, people I've, you know, we click, things happen, and then that brings on more jobs, more projects. And it's, you definitely do not have to go to film school to network, mm -hmm. but it's not, it's sometimes it helps greatly. Uh, and then other times it's just really getting out there and actually being on set. I think, a, I think yeah. a good question might like, too be, um, does the school you go to matter in this mm -hmm. case? Is yeah. that, is that mm -hmm. something that's important? Um, you know, if you go to, you know, University of South Florida, which is right here up the road, is there the same value as going up to UCF out in Orlando? Is there the same value going up to FSU, you know, up in Tallahassee? Mm -hmm. So is there a value to the location that you go to? Is that, is that, does that matter? Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, I would say that there is because uh, if you go to somewhere like California, go to school there, mm -hmm. then that's different types of people that you're going to meet who may have different connections. Uh, even the teachers there may have different connections versus the teachers here in Florida. So I would say that that's huge. All right, well, great. Thank you guys and see you all next week.